Chiefs placed Eric Berry on NFI, non-football injury list, which means he will be sidelined for the remainder of the season. And what that means is, essentially, during the Chiefs' Thursday night loss at Oakland, during the Raiders' game-winning 17-play drive, Eric Berry came to the sidelines afterwards and complained about chest pains. So the Chiefs gave him an x-ray the next day back in Kansas City, which they then sent him for an MRI, and then a CAT scan, and then a blood test, and they now believe that he does have lymphoma. They are sending him to see a specialist in Atlanta tomorrow. It will be the next 24 to 48 hours in which they fully determine exactly what is wrong with him. They are right now hoping for the best, but expecting the worst in regard to him. And a short time ago, Eric Berry did release this statement, and I read, I am truly thankful for all the support from family, friends, coaches, teammates, in the entire Chiefs Kingdom. At first, I was in shock with the diagnosis on Saturday and did not even want to miss a game, but I understand that right now, I have to concentrate on a new opponent. I've got great confidence in the doctors and the plan they're gonna put in place for me to win this fight. I believe that I am in God's hands and I have great peace in that. I know my coaches and teammates will hold things down here the rest of the season and until I'm back running out of the tunnel at Arrowhead. I'm so thankful and appreciative of being a part of this franchise playing in front of the best fans in the NFL. I will be back, and everybody is rooting for him. It's been an emotional day for Chief Safety Eric Berry. Nearly eight months ago, he was diagnosed with Hodgkin's lymphoma. And today, for the first time, he's been medically cleared to practice with his teammates. Frank Bull joining us now. He's an amazing guy. I'm just It's just an unbelievable story all the way around. Kristen Justin, all the people who face cancer and fight it, and they fight it head on, are very inspirational, like our own Cynthia Newsom and Gary Lezak. And Eric Berry is no exception. Forget about the fact he plays in the NFL football. Cancer is a fight for your life. Here's Berry's timeline. After that ugly loss to the Raiders last November 20th, he had chest pain and felt fatigued. She said trainer Rick Burkholder knew Barry isn't one to complain, so he and his staff went to work. On December 8th, he was diagnosed with Hodgkin's lymphoma. Barry went through treatment and was declared cancer free back on June 22nd. Last night, he was cleared to practice. Times where I was like, man, I don't know if I'm going to wake up tomorrow and I'll just be up, just up thinking, scared to go to sleep. And then it'll be a point where I was like, forget it. I'm going to sleep. If I don't wake up, I don't wake up. Fear nothing, attack everything. So that's, that's kind of what. How I kind of did the thing. So, bottom line, Barry fought something that millions of people are fighting every day. Hopefully, Barry's words, fear nothing, attack everything, and inspire them as well. You know I'm back, like I never left. I never left. Another sprint, another step. Another step. Another day, another breath. Another breath. Been chasing dreams. But I never slept. I never slept. I got a new attitude and a lease on life is a peace of mind. Seeking to find I can sleep when I die. Want a piece of the pie, got the keys to the ride and shit. I'm straight. I'm on my way. I'm on my way. Get up my way. I'm running late. What can I say? I heard you die twice. Once when they bury you in the grave. And the second time is the last time that somebody mentions your name. So when I leave here on this earth, did I take more than I gave? Did I look out for the people or did I do it all for fame? Legend is Exodus, searching for euphoria Trudging through the mud to find the present, no ignoring I got 20,000 deep up in the street like we some warriors My mama told me never bow your head Whoa. I feel glorious, glorious Got a chance to start again I was born for this, born for this It's who 
is uncharted territory here. So Barry's on Gronkowski. Mm. Yeah, you know, you don't know. Is it the cramp? Is it the turf monster? I mean, that's how Edelman got hurt in, in Detroit in a non-contact place. Caught his leg in the turf. So the crowd really still at the moment with a second down and 17 when play resumes. 